Hello children, watermelon. That's what you're going to be creating today um, using painting skills, okay? So um, I'll talk you through a demonstration to start off with and then it's going to be sped up the painting part of it, okay? So see you in a bit, take care, bye. Okay children, I'm gonna take a picture of a watermelon as an example and um, just to give you an idea, what I'm going to do from the bottom here, not over here or not down here, but just round about there, I'm going to draw a semicircle up to that corner, okay? Um, actually, I'll probably start around about there because this is going to be the fleshy part of the watermelon, okay? So the pink part. So you need your whole arm to draw this. So probably stand above your work and then draw it like so. Okay, I'm happy with that. So that's the pink part, like I say, the fleshy part of the watermelon. Then you've got the the wet part, the white part, sorry, um, there. And don't do it really thin, don't do it really thick. Probably about, probably about there, probably about the width of three of your fingers, okay? I'll do two of mine. Um, but you've got to be equal all the way. So it can't be like that or like that. So it's got to be the same, give or take a millimetre. So I'm quite happy with that. And this one, I'm going to take my time drawing that. I don't want to go right up there. I don't want to come right down here. Like so. And then there's this light green one here. But make it, the width of it, smaller. Around. And then you're going to do this one here, the darker green one. Don't do it too thin, probably about there. Okay, so you have, I've probably done it a bit too wide, but it doesn't matter. Dark green, light green, white with a really, really subtle hint of pink and a really kind of fleshy red colour there. And there's going to be a demonstration of painting with some words coming up, some key words to help you along the way. Okay.